Hey guys, it's the Tagline here with a video showing you guys three operating systems I am running on my netbook. So, <clears throat> you guys might be asking, why are you running three operating systems? Well, I'll answer your question, generic voice. Basically, I'm running three operating systems because this thing is slow, like really slow. So, I'll just go over quick specs. Um, 160 gig, 5400 RPM. Uh, it's one gig of RAM and uh, Intel Atom N270, which is a single core, 1.6 gigahertz processor. So let's show you three. We have good old Windows 7, Ubuntu, and Jolly OS. <coughs> Windows 7 I use mostly just to get programs and to install other operating systems. Ubuntu that was my first Linux run, and I pretty much like it, but and Jolly or Jolie OS, whatever you guys want to call it. So let's start off with that one. And I hope I pressed enter. Yes, I did. Okay. So I have little clouds going in there, <coughs> but whatever. And so we have that. Okay. <clears throat> so let's sign in. And there, so this operating system is based on the idea of cloud computing. So basically, everything is done in the cloud, and mostly what you have in front of you is a keyboard and a mouse plus a screen so let's go yep <clears throat> so it boots up really quickly just because it does everything on the web instead of your computer and automatically syncs to whatever you have so the layout is really simple and intuitive like I have open office writer you can also emulate windows programs on this so that's a nice plus. This is based off mostly social things, such as like <clears throat> your stream, or you can have Facebook, Twitter, or whatever. And yeah, so let's go to Ubuntu. <coughs> let's do a quick restart. And there you see the clouds rolling through the window. Okay. And let's go to Ubuntu. <coughs> okay. Let's use that. Okay. So now, first of all, I'm running this just because there are more apps for Ubuntu than Jolly OS. So, and uh, it runs, it boots up much, much faster than Windows 7 Starter. Well, the downside of Windows 7 Starter is you don't, you can't choose your background, but I will post a how-to on how to change your background later in the week, so be sure to subscribe to the tech line. Okay, so let's log in here. Doom, 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 doom. <coughs> okay. And there we go, it's booted up. So it runs pretty fast. I just have some of the added some apps such as Skype and Google Chrome, but these are the main apps that are included. You'll still need to get a lot of like plugins to do like Google Voice and video chat, which can sometimes be a pain on this kind of hardware, but if you're on desktop it'll be a breeze. So <clears throat> again I really like the layout of this, just all your apps on the side here. And then you have like all of your notifications at the top there and I just see how fast Google Chrome loads up. Just let's click on that. And there we go. 
So if you guys want to see a how to, we'll try to get that up because I'm not going to go through uninstalling and reinstalling this, but <clears throat> my editor does have the same thing and his warranty is still up, so <laughs> um, hopefully I can get him to donate his laptop. So that's it. <clears throat> For more how to's, reviews, and more stuff, be sure to be subscribed to the tech line, and we'll see you in the next video.